probably asking open-ended questions. I think that is the best way to get to know someone. What's been your biggest, one of the biggest lessons in sales, or you could even frame the question as what's the best sales tip that you have that you like to use a lot? Probably asking open-ended questions. I think that is the best way to get to know someone. Either you're trying to get to know them just in general, or you're trying to get to know their problems and help them fix. You don't want them saying yes or no. Either way. Either way, when you're trying to get to know someone, you know, what do you do? What do you do for a living? Where do you live? Just those kind of questions. Or you're asking, you know, how are you tracking your progress in the gym? How are you tracking your progress with your diet? Those are all open-ended questions. You know, be like, well, I want, I want to know more. I want to know more of the pain points like you were talking about earlier. That's that when the sales process, you're trying to find the pain points that you can solve in their life. So you're trying to provide that value and help them out, have them, help them have a better life. So asking those open-ended questions, you know, and just trying to get to, just trying to get to know them, really. That's probably the biggest thing I'd say. What about you? Okay. Yeah, love that. That's, that's basically the same thing I was going to say, just in a different way. I was going to say asking powerful questions. KJ Wong is a very successful sales professional based out of Australia. I forget exactly where, but he's been very generous with me and teaching me a lot about sales. And I think the biggest lesson I learned from him was asking powerful questions or asking the right questions. But I say powerful because, for example, when I worked at State Farm, I walked him through some of the questions I'd ask people and he would just be like, uh, you know, that's kind of that's kind of weak. You know, I was, and one of the questions I would ask people is, what would it take for you to switch your policy to state fund, right? And that, that might not be a bad question, but there was a better one. And so he had taught me and part of my process I started to use was to ask them something like this. How do you feel about your current insurance provider? And usually people are very short, like, I like it. Mm-hmm. And then, you know, you ask them, oh, okay, like, why? They'll tell you. Then the power question was, nice. Right, so, well, if you could change anything about what your insurance provider does or gives to you, what would that be? You know, or if you were the CEO of this insurance company, what would you do differently? By the way, if I could provide you all of the things you've got now, and usually the price was the pain point with a lower price, mm-hmm. would you consider switching to State Farm? <laughs>